Hi folks, this wasn't going to be a narrated video at all, but I discovered when I tried to upload it, YouTube doesn't accept any text descriptions that contain code snippets in. So I have to now do a proper video for it, but it's going to be quick. This is just the Conkey desktop hardware monitor or customized monitor you can do in Linux. And what I'm just showing here is I've developed some code snippet which I couldn't find anywhere else to change the CPU temperature color between red and green depending on whether it's above or below a certain threshold. I used 55 in this case, 55 degrees Celsius, just for illustrative purposes. But I'll quickly show now uh, what I've done on the code itself just so people can understand it and maybe apply the same thing. So here's the actual config file, the Conkey config file, and I've highlighted with the Red, tri a red rectangle is the part of a text I'm talking about. That's the if-else uh, condition uh, to check temperature. The important part is that highlighted in yellow part. That is the conditional statement. So in my case, that's the one that returns the temperature value from the LM sensors data on my computer. You could use it for anything further down. You'll see I've done a slightly different condition um, for the graphics card, for the GPU. So that can maybe serve as the example. Your part in the yellow there may differ depending on your computer, but I'll show you now where I actually get that from. And just following that is the value 55, which you can make 75, 65, 85, whatever you want it to be. And this is the sensors command that you run from the Linux terminal for any Linux computer to see uh, what hardware data it will return. And what was actually happening in that previous statement I showed you, the conditional statement, there was a command in the grep, G-R-E-P, and in uh, inverted commas it was looking for T-Die. If you look down here on the screen, I've highlighted T-Die. All that grep was actually doing is it was searching the sensors command, it was executing, or should I say, sorry, that there was an exec sensors command that executed this. Grep was then going down to find where the line was which started with TDI and it, was, it would have returned that whole line. But a bit further along in that condition you'll see I've cut, I've got a cut command and I've said character 16 to 19. It's extracting just the portion that shows the number and that in essence was then uh, returning the value of whatever the temperature was. So it's just to illustrate really also where that command in, in, in my case was getting the temperature from. If you run sensors on your Linux, it might be slightly different. Or you could change the TDI to anything else there, temp1 or uh, anything else to return the equivalent values or to set it for something else. But hopefully that just sort of ties the parts together very briefly as to uh, how it works. And I was quite surprised that I wasn't finding this conditional uh, color change for red or green. So I thought I'll just do a quick video and that's basically it. Stay safe and I'll see you in the next video.